did a bit of a Google search uh, for some mountains, some other mountains in that area where I'm staying on the Sunshine Coast in Queensland. And I found this one, Mount uh, Karura, I think they pronounce it, Mount Karura. And I'm about to start climbing it now. Apparently it's a little bit scary. Uh, there's some scrambling and some chains to hold on to. And I've only got a couple of hours of sun uh, daylight left. So here we go. Okay, so I'm about 30 seconds into my walk and I get that. Here we go. I've got a choice. This is the easy way. And then there's... I don't get that. Uh, quite honestly, I'm not sure which way to go. I'm going to go this way, the hard way. I've never been here before. I saw this mountain arise like a pyramid from Giza, you know. I thought, oh, you've got to be kidding. I'm going to do that in two hours. Well, here I go. I've never done this walk before. I this is my first time, but as they say, only mad dogs and Englishmen. I better get going. I'll see you later. small part of the way up but already the view is spectacular I just saw a kid with a mom about six years of age she did this and she looked as bright as a spark I gotta do it. Come pure, purely scrambling from here, but at least it's shaded because the sun's on the other side. Oh my gosh, what a walk. Oh. I just felt a few spots of rain on me. I, I really hope it was just a bat, <laughs> excuse me for being so rude, and not uh, rain. Because going down these rocks, wet is not what I want to do. I want to enjoy the view at the moment. Beautiful up here.
leaving the summit now and this is the part that I'm probably looking forward to the least and it's uh, going down and it's 40, more than 45 degrees and uh, here we go. That's straight. It's so like it's kind of like trying to trying to get an idea of the angle of this. It's really steep. Oh, oh. Oh, I don't want to drop my phone. Okay, I'm off the rocks now. I'm back onto the uh, onto the hard sort of hard ground, and uh, I, I learned. And uh, here's a tip, and I think the professionals do it this way: when you come when you're coming downhill on those chains, do it backwards. I mean, if the steps are clearly defined, if it's rugged as as most of it is, two thirds of it are very uneven and a bit uh, risky. If you go backwards, you're pulling onto the chain and, you, and it's, you can actually come down twice as fast or three times as fast quite securely because you're holding onto the, the chain. So uh, I'd recommend that. 